So welcome back, Morocco Method, where natural things happen. So today we have Martha, who's an employee at Morocco Method, and she has the classic three chop haircut, which I detest. Hairdressers basically cut one, two, three. So they just make a line here, <laughs> they make a line here, then they make a line here, and they call that, I'm not sure what they, what do they call it, Martha? Um, what are they trying to think they're doing? A wedge. A wedge. So you have to like really take your time, brush your client, comb your client, look at the waves, look at the parts, find out you know, what is this going to do? You know, does your hairdresser do this before? Or do they just say, oh, let's gossip and let me just start chopping your hair up. And did you hear about what happened on the street yesterday? It's like, that's not why you go to the hairdresser. You go to the hairdresser, it'll look beautiful and you want them to take care of your hair. Or do it yourself. And you can see that the potential of her waves are, look, look at that bounce, look at that potential shaping. And now what they do is they just chop the whole back up so there's, there's no shape to it at all. Actually, Martha, tell us what, they, what you've been doing for the last month that you worked at Morocco Method. It just has been growing out at such a weird pace just because it's cut in so many different layers. So one side isn't growing as fast as the other side and the back has just been growing so much faster than the rest of my hair. So I've just been putting up the back just so I don't have to like feel it ducktail on my scarves or shirts. So that's what I've been doing for the last month. Can you see that? It's right there. There's the underneath length and then look at all this. What's this? Just some, did she take a razor and cut you or a scissors? Scissors. She wow. Cut. She really just went like, psh, 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 psh. I mean, this how this hair is shredded. Mm -hmm. So look at this. Oh, she took thinning shears. Oh, she took thinning shears. So mm -hmm. that was, yeah, no, let, never let anyone do thinning shears on you. Never, never, never. So if you take a look at this hair, when I'm pulling it back, you can see like the thickness underneath my fingers. Look, and then look, it's just chopped up. So the top, so she used thinning shears and she destroyed this whole layer of hair. Nice mess. So we have to blend the sides to the back to the sides and the tops. We're going to blend this all back together again. So that's our goal. We want to get this as a corrective hair shaping. And then all of this will basically, you'll see, it'll all blend together. And then it'll start going into its natural wave pattern. So you can see this right here. And look at that. So we have this length, this length, and that length. So we basically just want to blend that all together. So it's nice and blunt. So when it falls, it's actually going to bring that wave pattern back in. So it's already starting to behave itself. It's pretty amazing. So how does that feel? It feels so much better and it actually looks really fabulous. So I'm like so excited. Yeah, the whole deal is to realize that you don't have to cut off a lot of hair. Like we're not styling hair, we're just shaping hair. So you really have to understand that you want your hair shaped, not chopped, not ruined. Not, you know, this three chopped thing, not razor cut, all that stuff. And then you're going to spend hours in the bathroom every morning or evening trying to style your hair with a blow dryer and rollers and doing all these tricks and wasting time. When it's not necessary, the whole foundation is just a good hair shaping, period. So in the morning, you can just set your hair like in two minutes. Brush it out. You look spectacular every day. But look what's happening already to this side. Isn't that great? to this wave. We just have to go ahead and brush it naturally to, to lock in. So the hair is going to lock in here and you're going to have these big wave patterns and you're going to have all this height. So instead of being flat, all you have to do is comb, brush over it, comb over it, and you start getting the natural height without having to set your hair. 